Okay, this is a tutorial on how to create the axle peg for the train in Autodesk Inventor. We're going to create a sketch. Again, we're going to use Revolve. So we're going to click Line and we're going to start drawing. Uh, this one is a little tricky because it doesn't come right and tell you, out and tell you how long the bolt should be. But if you look at your thread distinction, it tells you it's a quarter 20 UNC by one with a quarter inch offset. So it has to be at least an inch and a quarter. And then at the top here, we're going to put in our diameter for our head. And it tells us it is a 0.422 diameter divided by 2 because we're doing revolve. So we use the radius. Okay, so we got that. Then we're going to go up. And it tells us our distance up is 0.031. Just go ahead and connect those. All right, then from we can draw in another line here with a diameter of 0.25. So we're doing the radius divided by two. Now we need a dimension from here to here, and this is 0.125. We're going to do an arc here to here and it tells us the radius is 0.236 didn't connect there let's try it again Point two three six. okay now we need to go to the bottom our diameter for our bolt is 0.25, so we're going to put in the radius, which is 0.125, and we're going to draw straight up. Connect right there. Now we need to do our chamfer down at the bottom. It tells us our chamfer is a 45 degree, so we're going to select the third one, the third option on our chamfer. It's 45 degrees with a distance of 0.03. And we're only going to chamfer the one side. We're going to chamfer this. Okay, and we're not going to chamfer the whole thing because that would mess it up when we revolve it. Okay, hit OK there. Hit Finish. Hit your Home key to zoom in. Now we're going to do Revolve, and we have to make sure to select all of our sketches. Okay. Now if this, like this one, is not letting me select right there, what you can do is hit Cancel, double click on your sketch again. And then go in here and start deleting some of these dimensions. Okay, so we'll get rid of that. All right, and there we can see why possibly we were not allowed to connect is because those lines weren't the line wasn't drawn in. Okay, and then we can trim also this and this, and that will leave us the ability to revolve. Okay, now we're going to do a sketch on the top here, and we need to do a polygon. Okay, I'm going to draw that in, and now it tells us to dimension this. It is 0. Uh, it's 5 30 seconds across the flats, so 5 divided by 32. And we're going to hit finish. We're going to extrude. Change the direction. We're going to cut into it a, dis a depth of 0 0.111. Hit OK. Now we need to thread it. Select our threads. Length one inch. All right, we're, putting, we're leaving the offset at zero, even though it tells us it's a quarter inch offset, because we know that is now a quarter inch difference right there. Hit apply. Exit. And there is your bolt, your axle peg. Save that, and you're ready to go to the next one.